guys, quick update. Um, so, how to get this bolt out, this uh, bolt. So, turn on the air compressor, max. Uh, I put it up to 150 PSI. And um, how I got it out, so, take the harmonic, or harmonic balancer off. So, it was just like this with the nut in it. Then I ended up going to the back of the motor. I don't like that with the nut in it. I went to the back of the motor and put three wrenches. Not one, not two, but three wrenches. And make sure to always drop a little bit of oil, stuff like that around your pistons. So we're going to proceed to uh, take this front timing cover off all the way. Oh yeah, and then this just pulled off. Apparently, uh, there's supposed to be a removal tool to do it, but I just pulled it off, so I guess that's not the case. Alright, so these guys like some vibration, so I'm going to hit this uh, little hammer. Pull, maybe. Right, let's go to the screwdriver. Be right back. I'm just gonna keep hitting this part with the hammer, probably right here with the the rubber part. Oh, I hear it coming. All right, guys. So I've been kind of working away at it. Make sure you guys don't forget these bolts down here. There's just a couple. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, let's see if we get this thing off. Okay. Cool. I like. Take this little uh, pin out. Release the chain. These are all little dowels. It's pretty simple design, but it's pretty flawless, honestly. It's kind of like a rocker arm. Take this out. By the way, this could also be under load. So, this could also shoot back once I uh, take this off. Just be careful. 
And this is not procedure, by the way. I'm just possibly replacing everything here. So uh, this is how I'm taking it off. Alright, so I'm gonna have to play around with this. It's kind of like a bike chain, a little tied up, so gonna have to work it a little bit. Kind of pull this one up to get tension on this one. Just kind of a pain. <laughs> 